Hi, I'm Eddie Joles. Welcome back to VideoCreditScore.com. Today we're going to talk about credit score estimators. And maybe you've seen one of these out there. The question is, what is a credit score estimator? And what most people are talking about is a 10-question quiz, which you've probably seen uh, out there. There's one on the MyFICO.com website, which gives you an estimate of what your FICO credit score is going to be. So let's take a look. So this quiz has you know, a number of different questions asking you about credit cards. How many you have? When did you first open them? Um, you know, how long ago did you get your first loan? That's an important question for estimating your score. Um, you know, asking about your credit cards, how many currently have a balance besides mortgage loans? What are the total balances on those cards? Because that's going to make an impact. And then, um, have you missed any payments? And what does that look like in terms of the amounts that you've missed payments of? And then it's going to ask you some questions about your total credit utilization ratio and then balance or uh, bankruptcies. So, in my case, it's coming up with an estimate of 745 to 795. It's pretty good, right? So, that's a pretty good score. And what now I need to sort of ask the question, well, how accurate is it really? Well, there's a couple of factors which may affect the accuracy of this test. Well, one is, is, is are you actually able to recall all the facts correctly? Because some of the questions are a little tough. Like for me, remembering how many credit cards I have exactly is tough. I'm probably gonna get that number wrong because I think about my active cards, not the total number of cards that I actually have open. But here's the other thing is I've watched people actually do this estimator live and when they do it, they're just not as honest as you think they would be. They're, they're sort of in denial about what their current situation is and they're sort of self-selecting themselves into having a better estimate. And so that's a bit problematic. So in conclusion, I think this is a good guideline for estimating your score, but it is no substitute for getting your real FICO score. So I really encourage you to check your real FICO scores. You can do that through videocreditscore.com and you know where to find that. You can also friend me up on Facebook and follow me on Twitter and we'll see you soon. Take care. Remember, everyone's situation is different. Be sure to contact a financial advisor or a credit counseling professional before making important financial decisions. This video broadcast is for educational purposes and not a substitute for receiving personalized professional advice.